Hello, thanks for your order. My name is Ajit, so let's try to do this. Mm, so this is your website. So let's log in. Okay, so you send me the login information. Is order requirements mm -hmm. okay? So, this is your login. See your password. So what you want to do is you want to uh, you want to add the Thinkific course and the merchandise to the menu. Okay. Um, you want to add the course to the drop down menu. So let's go to appearance menus okay. so this is the current menu that you're having so what we need to do is we need to edit this menu so first first you want to add the courses so to the menu mm, uh, see requirements This is here, of course. So, procedure. Let's see our courses. Procedural basics. So, I, I'm guessing that this is the name of your course. for law students, right? Okay, so first we we'll just create custom link. We'll put your course you are, oh sorry. Uh, we'll put the text here and your course URL here head to menu okay so by default it goes to the bottom of your menu so we need to move that up menu okay, you can say put it here so instead of menu we can say menu and then we can say courses so that will be better so let's just save this Procedure basics for law students. So when you click that, it will take you to your course. Okay, so let's go back. Okay. 
so we can say menu and then we can say courses and then we can have something so if to do that what we can do we can create another one uh, custom we can create a custom link okay here we can just put a hashtag okay link text we can say courses so your theme okay so these are okay okay you can say courses add to menu okay so this one you can move it up put it under courses other menu i mean so under menu you have courses now this courses is right now is just a it's not a link it's just a hashtag i mean hash symbol and then you are just put the navigation label the navigation label is what will appear here so these are navigation label the name these names they are navigation label this is the link to which i mean this connects so um, remember that we are using custom links here um so let's do that and this one procedure basics uh, law students okay, we just move it a bit here so how this works is you can see that level right this is the first level the menu all right so if we move courses to the same level let's say see uh, let's say let's say we move them both to the same level okay Okay, let's just uh, uh, since we have other things here, that's why we are not able to move. So we let we let to let's say we'll just move it here below. Okay. okay. So let's see. See, so we have moved courses and this one to the same level. Okay, same level as the menu. So if if we do that what happens is that it will become the primary menu like the primary line here so let's check so if you refresh this see it has shown up as the this is what we added so it becomes the main no drop down direct okay so what you wanted was that you wanted it under the menu here so we move it up and just move it a bit like this okay procedure basics for law students so let's say we move it again one more level so you can see that this is the first level when you click on that this will open and you click on that again this will open so let's say and let's check how that works okay. so we save that now if you refresh okay. menu courses and then courses as your first course so you also wanted to add another course coming soon course right you said um, that you said Okay. 
Because of the Okay, I start. You also had another course, networking and not one and say coming soon. Networking one not one and say coming soon. Okay. So another course networking one not one. So less. So you want to also say coming soon. So with uh, that needs to be a that needs to be a page. So let's create a page. Let's create add new. Networking one not one. So I don't know what that error is about, but. That is about. It will just ignore that pages. Add new. So for so some reason you are getting an error here. I'm not sure why that's happening. It's not letting me create a page. Check your pages, all pages. Okay, we'll just use the sample page. Mm. There's something wrong with your website because this is not supposed to happen. I'll try to um, edit it in the front end. Sample page. Let's try it. Uh, Try it in, let's try it in Beaver Builder. Let's see if we are still getting that error. Okay, so we are not getting error here. So we'll just use this.
can rather we can make it like headline to heading to save it I can let's uh, let's make it center coming soon save this we cannot edit here we will edit it done uh, and say publish let's, let's go to edit page now this will take you to the back end okay still getting this error in the back and for some reason so there's something wrong with your uh, something wrong with your website anyway I'll just uh, so I think this is the page we Yes, edit it. Yes, yeah. yeah, this is the page we edited. So let's change. Let's do a quick edit. Let's change the name to Networking One Not One. Let's update this. Okay, so we just created a page called network one not one we actually did not create a page we edited a page because it's not letting us create a new page so but I think for now I mean to show you this is what I can do okay, networking one not one coming soon here you can you will notice that this is still the old one to change that you need to uh, use the edit button here and then ch change the permalink it we okay we have option here sample page so this we can say networking 101 so the slug is nothing but this URL here the ending it cannot have space that is the reason why we are putting a dash here so networking dash 101 you can click update now if you view this page yeah so you can see that the URL has changed and you can see networking 101 coming soon okay so now let's go back to our menu so appearance menus now here you can see pages so we click view or then we have to find your page so the networking one not one so this is the page we created we click that and we click add to menu so yeah it went to the bottom of the page so we drag that under courses we put it as the same level as this one otherwise it will become a sub menu so, okay. so this is the main menu when you move it to the side it becomes a sub menu if you move it again to the side it becomes again a sub menu of this sub menu if you move this then this will become sub menu of this so we don't want that so we are putting them in the same level so let's do that and let's change I mean let's save <laughs> so, okay once we save that now let's check what happened let's click on home all right so home a menu you have courses then courses has these two and you click networking one not one it will take you to the page and say coming soon 
Okay. Now the second the other thing that you wanted me to do was uh, So you want to add merchandise after the menu. So let's create that menu, appearance menu. So that's again custom link since it's a URL. Okay, now first we'll put the text merchandise and this will be the link to your store. Uh, so Tisha store. Close your arrow. Mm I'm guessing that this is your t-shirt store you are uh, okay I think t-shirt is essential um, I'm guessing this is the one Okay, so, so let's copy this one. Let's go back to the menu. Let's paste that. Add to menu. Okay, after menu before affiliate store. So this is menu, it's affiliate store. We'll just minimize this. Menu, affiliate store. So we'll just move it above affiliate store. Here, same level as this. Then we same menu. merchandise if you click on that it will take you okay. okay then you wanted me to add the video to add the video somewhere video mm. you want to add this video to the menu or to a page so let's check this video hi i'm Randy from networking for law students llc Part of networking is participating in a well-run mini in a law student organism newly revised. A matter of taking a test. The second part is a procedural PowerPoint video with seen where members are not an interactive networking course for law students that is tentatively scheduled to be released in summer of 2020. So please don't share your login information with anyone else. We want people to buy this and the money is going toward a good cause, your meetings and in your careers. Thank you again. Okay, so 
So it's a good place to add the video will be your home page. So let's try. can try editing the classic way but if it gives that error then we can use the beaver filter or the elementor something went wrong okay we can try elementor okay so just let's visit the site So you actually have two page builders installed for some reason. So we we'll just think this is built on Elementor, so we'll just try Elementor. I don't see this section with us hidden okay anyways I'll just add it here just add a video before that we let insert a section why is appearing this way you are done you have actually set the home page as as the block page that's the reason why all this is showing up so you need to set the home page as a static page so let's check the pages again pages all pages a page called home about us I guess on that home front page elementor okay let's check customize Page settings. Hmm, it's correct. The home page is a static page. This page. Okay. It's correct.
Uh, I'm not sure what you have done here so I, I will just I will not make any changes here I will just exit this page uh, page so not I will just show you what to do how it's done on another page okay so I'll just use uh, Try this. Okay. So we just add the video. YouTube, we change that to self hosted. This file, so your, this your video, so just uh, download it. This is the so let's upload this. If you upload it to YouTube and then uh, put a link, it would be better. But yeah, it's giving an error. It's probably because the file is too big. Okay, it's giving an error. So to show you, I will just use another video. Um, okay, wait a second video. I just use a small video just to show you. Okay, let's 
Set media. So this is how your uh, page will look like if you make changes. So this is how you add a video. So I will not make changes to this page because I don't know if I should be doing that. So I'll just leave it as it is but that's how you add a video. So since you are using Elementor here, these are the elements, you just drag and drop it like that below or above can drop it here or if you can even drop it here here or here and then these will have another options so that's how you do that so okay I will not make changes to this page but that's how you add a video uh, so let's uh, just exit. And thank you again for the order. If you have any doubts, you can let me know, and I'll help you with it. Um, thank you. I hope the video is okay. I don't usually record videos. Uh, what I usually do is um, live tutorials. So <laughs> sorry about the. Uh, background noise and the bad quality audio <laughs> thank you